again everyone so it's Tuesday it's time for the little round another go around and uh, today we're going to focus on something new to the den something new from summer break soaps cannonball uh, always want to try this it seemed very interesting um, it is a crop uh, normal consistency um, scoop down a piece there and I cheated a bit today to shorten down the video um, because I pre lathered right here and it didn't take long to lather um, at all it's got a nice and pleasant scent now what's special about this is containing menthol but it's synthetic menthol and it also has chlorine in it. Yes, you heard me. Chlorine. Um, but we'll get on to that. <clears throat> pre shave which is on, we might be able to tell. Uh, just two days of growth here, because I did shave a, two, a couple of days ago. Brass of white with eucalyptus oil in it to take away the bad scent or smell. Um, we are going to be using a Parker. And right now I don't remember the name, but I'll put that in the description. And a Wilkinson sword. That's third use on this. And this razor is a medium verging on to the aggressive. And I'm using the Yaki Atlantis brush because you know, uh, sort of, sort of a, a theme here going on. So yeah, that's another. I did pre lather this uh, when I got it and after I unboxed it uh, because it's a new artisan to me and I I always check how my skin reacts to that sort of base um, and it it's even very well you know to work well um, and there's some eucalyptus in the pre-shave so that is going to hint uh, into sort of what's the word I'm a bit tired excuse me that it's going to connect with the synthetic menthol but I know how the synthetic menthol felt like because I preload preloaded and uh, pre lathered sorry and put it on my skin just to see how it felt so I know Well, this looks great, as you can tell. Hopefully, a bit dry now. We'll be putting in some more water. So, menthol feel wise, it is there. It's not in your face, cryogen uh, there. Um, but it is present, you feel it on your skin as a sort of a nice cooling breeze. And the aftershave is a bit special, also containing synthetic menthol. But it is said that you could get a feel of menthol in up to eight hours after using the soap oh the, the aftershave sorry um so that's interesting <coughs> excuse me now the scents on this so is unique we'll be winning this and we'll be having a first pass and uh, talk about the scent um, it has some tropical scent notes to it. Um, I pick up some orange, some pineapple, I think. I'm, I'm not sure. Web to the website that, uh, and and I'm not really sure if I could find it. It eluded my eyes. Uh, what else yes yeah it's difficult to describe 
it's nice it's fresh it's 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 summery um and then to the to the main question do you get the chlorine yeah you do um you kind of get it like you're sitting on the edge of a pool and um you're having a nice tropical drink and that's the exact same description um the artisans has made uh, made for the soap don't get any eyes Go for a second pass now, huh? It's nice and refreshing, as I, as I said. Whoops. Um. So so yeah, if you like fruity, citrusy scents, um, this might be for you. I mean, they're more cooling on the face now, actually. So you get the. Synthetic menthol as well. It's not like the other one that I tried. What was that called? Hacks, voodoo. I got no no menthol feel from that. And it has synthetic menthol in it as well. Overhangs on this razor to be aware of. What is this 65? I'll put it in the description. Now, nice protection in the soap. Let's see the residual slippers. Good as well. Not excellent, but it's okay. You could go a few times, then you have to stop. And I had a weeper there because I had a pimple. Let's see here over again. But then I can't go anymore. Then it's a bit dry. But I put water on, and it's good again. So it's it's. The residual slightness is okay. Now I did work up to do this review because my initial thoughts the scent I was like, what is this? very unique but once you've gotten used to it well not you once I have gotten used to it I am um, I actually enjoy it I like it and I enjoy it now um, same as the sterling the strawberry lemonade I didn't enjoy that scent when I initially smelled it but using it a few times, I end up very much liking it. I went, and I'm in the first review. I said I'm not going to be rebuying this at all. But now I am. You know, if I run out, or when I run out, I will be buying it again. Same thing with this soap. Um, the first time I smelled it, I like now. Ah. But I gave it a few whips over the next couple of days after I got it, and I actually ended up smelling it. And then, hmm, it's actually good um, because somehow you. you when you see a label and you hear a description, you get a, or oh, I do, sorry, I get uh, an imagination of what is this going to smell like. If it's, if it's not in that bowl area, I kind of need some time to adjust and get used to this scent that is really is, has got. Um, 
Ja. But it's a good scent, it's nice, it's fresh, it's summerish, you know? Um, you could use all year, year round if you want, you could do whatever you want, really. that deeper hmm. but that was me and it is a pimple you know so you do have a tendency of, of cutting them open or well, I do oh, let's see here where this is not in here See here. Nice. I'm really going to town this one. So, I believe this is it. I'll do a fish wash and whatever remains. I'll see you at the post shave. So, we're back and uh, did a fish wash with the remaining soap. It's a bit left there. But, um, and I must be saying, uh, by the way, I just got the Allen block I'm trying to stop this. Um, on alum is a good thing it's a natural thing find it in nature don't do that and use it <laughs> i won't recommend that but um yeah if you get a wee bit it's good to try to close it at the very least it's it's good natural product to put on your skin um it's kind of my enemy i'm not putting it all over because it's also tightening the skin and that makes my skin red and irritated now afterwards i've put on water and i went to get this and I really feel, felt the artificial menthol on my skin. Very nice, very cooling. I will be using some fierce wood chasel. Also some very nice products to put on your skin, wood chasel. Rose water is huge benefit for my skin. Now let's use this. Um, it has alcohol in it and wet hazel as well. So, but before we do, I'll just go over what we used. Parker razor. Don't remember what what number. I apologize for that. I really do. And the Wilkinson sword. Let's see. Um, there you go. Uh, third use. <clears throat> Yaki Atlantis. Great brush. Really great brush that Yaki provides. I'm actually waiting for a new brush from Yaki. A 30 millimeter one. Huge. And the room ball worked. It's a treat. It's always. Um, pre shave. Prosser white. With eucalyptus to take away the bad smell. And this soap, 
I must say I am really impressed. Um, it's not the best soup that I've used, it's not the worst soup that I've used. It's got a nice scent, nice protection, nice glide. Post shave could be a slightly better, um, but this got a lot of artificial menthol in it, so I like that as well. Let's try this. Um, alcohol. Same ish scent as the uh, soap. <laughs> Ooh. And yes, there's a burn. Ooh. Nice scent. Fruity. Fresh. Citrusy. Nice combination. Nice feel in the skin. There's some mental feel to it as well. So, that was a good one. Very recommendable this as well, especially in the summer period as the uh, sort of arts on the label indicates. So go check it out if you wish. Um, and, but no matter what, stay safe and stay healthy and all well, those mental coming out. Nice. Um, and, you know, we're going to see you, I hope I'll come to see you on Saturday. I don't know how much time I'm going to be having then. Perhaps the video is going to be up late. This is still bleeding pretty bad. Um, taking the daughter to a birthday party. So, not sure if I'll be able to put something up during that day. Uh, but we'll see. Yeah. Meanwhile, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.